Alrighty, hello guys, Lucky Me Faces back to another video on my channel. Today we are obviously continuing on with our build, and this is actually looking pretty good. I would say that the outside of this thing is actually looking pretty sick. Uh, there are a few things that need doing, and one of those things is... I kind of feel like adding windows uh, to the outside of this. Uh, a few of you guys have actually said that we should add turrets, uh, which is kind of interesting, uh, and stuff like that. So we're going to try and make this thing look a little bit better today. Hopefully that goes well. Um, let's get on with it. Okie dokie. So let's go ahead and get on the inside of this thing and take a little look around. So as you guys can see, this is the bit that was built first. This is the bomb bay. Now a few of you guys, in fact one of you guys, uh, has said maybe you should actually put a ramp at the back so that you can actually store things inside the aircraft. Now I'm not sure about adding a ramp to do that, but I am thinking maybe a cargo door would be good. Uh, and then this area at the back can actually be a cargo area. Uh, we can have the bombs below, which would be fine, and then we can actually have some sort of, like, surveillance room right here, so we can have, like, a radar and stuff like that in this little bit, and then obviously the bombardier site at the front, cockpit, etc. Um, yeah, that would be pretty cool. Maybe. Okie dokie, so with that being said, if we did want a big cargo door, where would it go? I think really far towards the back, to be honest. Uh, I'm actually thinking from about this point right here to probably about this point right here. And then obviously upwards, and maybe even inwards. There we go. So we'd actually cut this uh, the way it is. Cut it like so. Uh, cut. There we go. Uh, paste it in there, and then maybe actually we can actually add this bit down here as well. Because uh, I think that would work out. Yeah. Alright, hold on. Let me grab that too. In fact, we can just delete this. Do, 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 do. Delete that to there. Delete it all the way along until the end. And then we can actually add new stuff, which is just this, to the bottom of there. All the way along. To the end. There we go. Alright, epic. So it is only on one side, but that's okay. Delete this right here. Delete it right there as well. Get ourselves a pivot and see if we can actually make this work. So that'll go right there like so. And then we need it the opposite on this side. Which, let me figure it the issue out. There we go. Excellent. And now they're both the same. So now we merge this with this. And we merge this with this. And now that should be a big old cargo door that we can actually load things into and... Take things out of, maybe. Alright, switch box it is. Let's do this. Uh, so switch box is going to go directly in the Kia. We're actually going to go ahead and hide it in the floor. That'll be fine. And we're going to attach it to both there and there. And that's okay. We'll go ahead and make this... When the value is 1, it opens. Yes. It also means, uh, this little bit on the bottom, actually means we can open up the door via a button uh, that should work out. So... Put this on both sides. There we go. Toggle button. Both sided. Put it right there. Link this directly to there. And let's go see if it works. Yeah. Hopefully it does. Uh, there could be an issue, but we'll see. So run to this side. Press the button. Yeah, it's the other way around. Okay, so it's minus one when the button is on. That's essentially all we need to change here. So minus one when the button's on. Go. Yeah. All right. Run around to the other side. Let's see what we can do here. Press the button. Cargo door opens. That's pretty sick. It needs to look better than that. But other than the way it looks, that's pretty cool. Okie dokie. So with that being said, let's go to the back end. And we'll actually go ahead and sort that out straight away. So essentially, we need to delete this little bit right here. And maybe even this bit and this bit as well. There we go. Excellent. We will do this uh, right there. Excellent. And we'll fill that in. Very good. And honestly, we'll actually fill that to the end. Good. We'll then do this all the way down here. And then this again, I guess, uh, all the way to there. And then that being the roof uh, is is weird, but honestly, it's fine. Is that actually the roof? I'm so confused. That's not even the roof. This isn't the roof. What is that bit then? I'm confused. Uh, but anyway, <laughs> we should be able to add this to here like so. Good. Wait, no. I'm so confused. Delete this. There we go. And put it there instead. There we go. Excellent. Paint all of this the way it should be painted. And all of that. There we go. Now we should be good. Now we should be good. We'll then do the same to this area. Have it extend all the way to the back. And uh, we'll have like a raised floor back there and it should be good. Yeah. Okay. So with that being said about the raised floor, let's actually delete all of this that I've literally just put in. Uh, we're going to put ourselves a floor in, which is made of this. And we're going to do this all the way to there. Okay, excellent. We're then going to fill all of these in the way we should. All the way to the back. Do this one all the way as well. All the way to there. We're going to do the same with this one. 
All the way to there. Excellent. This piece is obviously a bit of an issue, but that's probably fine. In fact, let's do the rest of this on both sides. There we go. So delete that right there. Um, we can actually extend this backwards a little bit further. All the way to the back, pretty much. We're going to fill the back end in by doing this. There we go. Excellent. And honestly, we're going to fill this in too. So delete these guys up to about there. Delete these guys as well. We'll fill all that into there. And we'll honestly do this as well. Okay, good. So that now is a cargo bay. Uh, just a little bit at the back. And that's pretty cool. We'll actually delete these as well. Uh, on both sides. We'll delete this bit as well. Yep. And we'll extend this all the way out to here. So that the door is in the right place. If that makes sense. I, hopefully that makes sense. Uh, grab this. Go ahead and do that. Bam. Alright, very good. Fill that in like that. Excellent. And that's all good. Nice. I'm actually pretty pleased with this. Um, right, so, from there, we're then going to do this. Okay, excellent. This is the cargo room, uh, as we already know. Um, and it should be good. Fill that in right there, excellent. All of this is already done, except this piece needs to do it now. Hold on, uno momento. Alright, do this bit, all the way across to... Let's do it to Kia for now, and then we need extra pieces to there. Good, okay. It's actually looking fantastic back here. Hopefully we'll be able to dip underneath this uh, and actually get down here because I'm thinking beds. I'm actually thinking beds. Yeah. I want them to be able to fold out though, so how do I do this? <laughs> how do I do this? I don't know. Okay, so if the crew wants to sleep, we can actually put a bed right there like that. And honestly, if we go even further, uh, we can probably put another bed in, but we won't do that. This will just be a resting area for the crew. Uh, just in case they need it, which, I mean, they might, but at the same time, maybe they won't. So, there we go, do that there. We'll actually fill this in all the way down to there, excellent. And, yeah, this will be like a little board bunk room uh, for people to, to sleep in. I think that makes sense. All right, fill this in all the way down to here, and honestly, we'll do this as well. I don't know whether we should have a door on this. Uh, probably not, but that's cool. That actually totally works. Yeah. We're going to paint the roof too. Uh, it should actually be the same color as everything else. That's probably fine. Uh, we're going to change the color of the beds and stuff to be a different color. It doesn't really matter what color the, the sheets and stuff are. In fact, delete the beds. We'll actually start with them being white. Um, purely because then the sheets are white and stuff like that. And it makes it look a little bit more normal, I guess. Because usually you have white sheets. So that's okay. We'll actually have green surrounding them. And... We might actually put this in the middle. Yeah, why not? There we go. So it's like a separate bed uh, for the crewmates, just in case they need it. And that should be fine. We'll also put a seat in here on both sides. There we go. And two seats. So in case we need it, we've got seats in here. We've got beds in here. We're all good. All right. Nice. All right. Let's put this down here. Bam. There we go. Excellent. And honestly, uh, we need to move this, but that's all right. We can do that. And we need this to come downwards. So we'll do this. Uh, delete these. Put that in. We need to move this guy out of the way. So cut it. And we can honestly just move it backwards to behind the door. Behind the wall. Uh, and there we go. Bam. Paste it there. Merge it. There we go. Excellent. So in here we delete this. We go and put that in. And now we can get down into the bedroom. And that's cool. We get our cargo area as well. Which is excellent. And, yeah, it's becoming a bit of an all-round aeroplane, which isn't bad, to be honest. That's not a bad thing. Hopefully we can get in here. We'll also add some um, equipment here as well. Because I'm, I'm starting to think it is sort of necessary to add equipment. So, yeah. Fire extinguisher, always, always important. We'll actually have two of those back here. We'll have first aid kits back here as well. One there and one there. And then we need to figure out what else is actually necessary. Um, I'm thinking a welder. Alright, welder on this side. On the other side. Actually, welder as well. There we go. We go with welders. Welders on both sides. Good. And then is there anything else that we really, really need? I don't think there is, uh, honestly. So I think we'll go with a flare, actually. A flare right there and a flare right there. Yep. Same on this side. Bam, bam. And we're good. Let's make sure we can actually get to that point. Let's go. da 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 Okay, so door opens. Uh, obviously, to get inside, we don't have a current door for the rest of it, but that's okay. Go ahead and close this down. 
This is like a little cargo area for all of our cargo. Very good. Uh, if we drop down and we go underneath here, we've obviously got seats. And we've got beds. And then we can actually make our way back out. Yeah, it's a good use of the space, I think. That's cool. Okie dokie. So, with all that being said, uh, I feel like we need lights back here, obviously. So, we'll actually add a light somewhere underneath here. Probably around here. Good. Let's get ourselves a light. Let's go ahead and just smack that straight in here, shall we? So, a light bulb. Go ahead and put that in facing downwards. And there we go. We're going to go ahead and paint the rest of this. Like so. And honestly, we need, like, stuff in here. We do. We need we need stuff in here. So on there and there and then there. We'll actually get ourselves some anchors. And we'll put all the anchors in. And hopefully, once we put all of these in, it makes a little bit more sense. Yeah, this is cool. This is cool. Alright, so we should be able to tie down anything that actually goes in here, which is excellent. And I think that's literally all we need. We don't need much more than, than that. Uh, which is very, very nice. Um... Right, okay, cool. So now that we've done that, anything else that needs adding? I feel like we need to add more lights. So we'll actually add another light in here. Light, let's go ahead and put that on the ceiling back here. We want it to be green, just for now. So delete this, put the green light in. Excellent. Uh, we don't need too many lights, so that's okay, but put another one here. And there we go, we should be good. That should be enough lights for, for that area. Okay, good. So now we go to this, we go to this, we go to this, and we change the color of the lights to... Honestly, I don't know. I always go with cream or brown because it makes a nicer light. So we will actually do that with all of these, and hopefully that'll be okay. There we go. Nice. Okay, cool. Let's see if this works then. Button. We'll put a toggle button in here. I'll actually put it in the floor. For the lights. I know that's weird, but there you go. We need to paint both sides. Like this, and like this. And then this is going to be our light switch. Lights. Okay. Connect it up. Let's go. Bam. There we go. Good. Literally, I'll need to one light. That's fine. And then we need the lights for up here to work as well. So we'll delete this. Get ourselves another button. Make it green. And put it in. Good. This is also going to be lights. Okay, attach this to there, attach it to here, and we should be good. Nice. All right, spawn it in. Let's go see what that looks like, and then we'll see what it looks like on a nighttime too. All right, here we go. Bam. And bam. Okay, excellent. So make it nighttime so we can't see anything. That is enough light. That's pretty good. Yeah. If we're storing stuff up here, that's excellent. If we are uh, asleep down here, that's excellent too. Yeah, we've also got the storage room, obviously, for these things. Uh, we also have a hell of a lot more room for everything else if we needed to. We could delete these walls and put stuff in them. Uh, and then we need to sort out the front later. But for now, this is good. This is actually completely fine. Right, so even though I think we should actually finish there, I do want to add windows to this. Now, I'm not entirely sure how I'm going to add windows. I'm not sure what the windows should look like. Uh, but let's go ahead and take a little look and see what we can do. So... I don't think I need windows in the back. Uh, a turret would be kind of cool on the top of here, but we'll leave that for now. Uh, some windows in here would be excellent, actually. Probably only at the front and pretty much nowhere else. So let's do this on both sides and we'll delete like three, maybe. There we go. Something like this. Uh, and we'll try and build windows into there. I don't know how that's going to go, though. Yeah, like that. That is a big space. I'm not sure. Okay, so what I'm thinking is that that's actually, like, it's too much. It is actually too much to do anything with most of this. Uh, so I feel like if we just add this, like so, all right, like that, there we go. And then we add the window, the, sorry, this bit back, like this. That window looks weird, and I'm not sure I like it. <laughs> I really don't know if I like that window or not. I, I feel like I don't. But then again, I don't really know why not. So, spawn it in. Let's see what it looks like from the outside. Yeah, it looks weird. It it looks wrong. Square windows are obviously a bad idea in a plane. But there's, it, it's a square game. It's pretty much a... We have round windows, though, don't we? I don't know whether I'll be able to put those in properly, though. So, delete this and this. Uh, these are our windows. We have portholes. Which, if we would actually be able to, like, angle this, it would be fine. But I don't think it's really that possible. Like, 
I'd have to angle it from inside, and uh, I don't think I've got room to do that. I don't know if I do have room to do that, so... Hang on. <laughs> so, hang on, let me try this. So, get ourselves a pivot. Alright, get ourselves a pivot, robotic pivot. Make it in green, actually. There we go, so put that in there. Good. We'll then attach this to here. Okay, weird, but okay. And then we're going to go forwards. Two. No? I don't know. Window? Yes, grab one of these. Alright, it's going to have to go down, obviously. Yep. My bad. Alright, there we go. Have it go forwards. And then put it on there. Okay, so put this on here like so. Excellent. Uh, get ourselves a throttle lever, and we'll see if we can make this work. So put that there for now. Attach this. To there, attach this to there, that's okay. We'll have a minus number on here just to make sure it works. And we'll be good. So minus one. Go. I don't know which side I've done uh, right and which side I've done wrong here, but let me just go ahead and put on infinite electricity. Okay. Okay, right, actually, this might work. So, delete this along here. Go ahead and put this piece in, like so. Spawn this in again. See what it does. Because I think we can make this look good, honestly. And when I say that, obviously, maybe not. <laughs> right, okay, hang on. Hang on. I, I need, like, a little platform so that I can see what's going on up there. Uh, I also need to delete most of the stuff. So I need to delete this, 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 and that. There we go. It should be able to still rotate, which will be fine. And that'll be good. Okay, I also need a little platform to stand on. So let me go down from here, do this. There we go. Go! Because then we'll need to figure out how big the thing needs to be and stuff. So do this. Do that. Oh, yeah, that's not right. That's very wrong. That is extremely wrong. We, we can't have it working like this. Yeah, but at the same time, I mean, there is a possibility that that is actually fine. But at the same time, it's just not. So I'm not sure what to do here. Ah, that's annoying. That's really annoying. It's close, though. What if I literally just do this? Hang on, right. Paint these uh, like that and that. Paint that as well. Get ourselves another pivot, obviously. Pivot. Here we go. Go ahead and put the robotic pivot right here. Excellent. Get ourselves the... Actually, do it from here. Do this. Get ourselves the thing. The, um... Porthole. That's what it's called. Per, 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 per. Porthole small. Put it there. Delete this, 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 and this. Attach this directly under there. And directly under there. Good. Delete this one. And put this back in. Very nice. Go! This isn't gonna be... This isn't gonna work either, is it? Oh, maybe it will, actually. Alright, do this. I mean, it looks weird, but it somewhat works. And then, and then we might be able to even have, like, a, a double thing here. Alright, this is going to be weird, but let's see if this works. So put this here. Spawn it in. Run over here. Yep, it looks weird already, but that's okay. Do that. A little bit less. Okay, so around 0.27. Yeah, and you know what? I think that'll work. I think it will actually work. Let's do it. Let's have that. Alright, so delete this, delete this, delete this, delete this, 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 and this, and this, and this. There we go. Get ourselves a number, and all we have to do is make it 0.27 or 0.28, or whatever. There we go, so put this right here. The number is going to be 0.27. Actually, we're going 0.28 for now. Okay, good. Attach this to there. Attach it to there as well. Spawn it in, see what it does. Sick. Yeah, no, this works. That looks okay from the outside. From the inside, is it going to look okay as well? We might be able to do something with that, I think. Probably. Yeah, okay, cool. So if we were to do something with that, what would it be? It would probably be to do this. Down to there, obviously fix this into there, and then we'll probably do this to there, 
and then all the way along to there as well. Okie dokie, that's only done it on one side, but I think it'll work. So spawn it in. Let's get over there and have a little look at it. Bam, 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 bam. Yeah, you know what? We can make this work. We can totally make this work. That's cool. Yeah. Nice. Well, anyway, uh, now that we've done that, I think I'm actually going to go ahead and end this video here. Thank you guys very much for watching. Uh, let me know what you guys think about this window setup. I think it will actually work out. Obviously, they're more rounded than uh, than the other ones are. Uh, and that actually looks like it might work out for us. We could put like a few in the front. Probably none in the middle. Probably none at the back. Uh, we then need to add turrets and stuff as well. We'll probably do that as well. Um, yeah, I think that's pretty cool. Nice. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. See you in the next one. Goodbye.